we brought the material back into the lab after pulling a sample from the truck and we're going to be splitting out for burn off, rices, and our gyratories. This is a gyratory mix we're doing today is how we're going to run it through the riffle splitter. And the first thing we're going to start with is a release agent. We're going to spray down the riffle splitter so we make sure none of the material sticks to the riffle splitter. Important thing for the riffle splitter is to make sure it's clean, that all the chutes are clean with no debris in them so you're not contaminating this mix from a previous mix that might have gone through here. So we're going to run it. First we're going to take the material into the riffle splitter and we're going to start blending up the material several times to so make sure we have no segregation. If you have a segregated sample The test, me test methods we're looking for today is a burn off, two rices, and two dryer tools. We're going to take our, the one side, split it down, and that will become our two dryer tools. So those can go into pans and then go into the oven so they're the correct temperature to run dryer tools. And the other half we're going to split directly in half and one side it will be saved for in case we need to rerun a test. And then the other side is our burn off and two rices. That portion is for our burn offs, so we can put it on the table until we're ready to run it at a later time. And then the material that's left is our two rices. So we'll cut it directly in half, and that's our two rices. Rices typically are 1,500 to 2,500 grams. Burn off is also 1,500 to 2,500 grams. So that can be placed on the table to cool off and that's how we split out a gyratory.